an actor, an investor, and an entrepreneur. Guys, please welcome on stage Rana Dagupati. Thank you, Rana. Exciting social shopping retail space for this new generation. So thank you for coming here and wish us luck on this new dynamic journey in, at Broadway. Thank you. You know, Rana, as you were introducing Broadway, you know, a couple of things which I heard over and over again were commerce and media, you know, uh, online and maybe in the last hundred years. Uh, whether you see the first mall that was ever built in England and you see them today, it's pretty much the exact same thing, exact same offering. But as consumers, we've changed very dramatically. We want to know what we wear. We want to know what we use. Uh, we want to understand the ethic of uh, the brand and how it's built. And very rarely do you find these, this available. A brand never or the founder never gets to speak to the consumer directly in this form. And we thought at Broadway, that's the, that's the best blend that we can do, where in the last five, six years, there's been a great emergence of D2C brands that have come with very, very interesting storytelling. But it only restricts them to digital platforms, whether it's Instagram, Facebook, in that world. And, and there's nothing superior to touch and feel and really understanding where things come from. So I think that's, that's really the blend that we want to bring in at Broadway. Broadway's marketplace catered to the needs of the 21st century consumer. Uh, Rana, I think the, the starting point, I think, as we all have been kind of imagining Broadway together, was that 45% of India is, in some sense, born in this century. And for this India, or uh, even more, uh, I think they're all digital natives. They're born in a world where social media is their platform, where they consume news, entertainment, brand discovery. It's a place where uh, their shopping preferences are being shaped and newer influences are emerging from them. I think a lot of digital first brands, D2C brands have been born in that era, in that environment with consumers. But I think as you rightly kind of pointed out that, uh, you know, every time, let's say, these brands have to kind of engage with consumers in physical retail forms. Uh, if they have to engage, these brands have to tell their stories in a physical environment, uh, what that potentially would look like. Uh, so I think uh, this is a generation, uh, you know, whose attention span is 15 seconds, 20 seconds. Uh, it is a, uh, it is a generation uh, whose needs are micro, micro segmented, and therefore so many brands have been kind of uh, building solutions for these, for this generation. Uh, this is a generation, in some sense, also which doesn't want to consume what the previous generation consumed. So I think Broadway, in some sense, is giving life to some of these trends where we want to create a space for a curated set of brands, uh, brands that are really, uh, you know, have a great narrative, great story of why they exist in these consumers' lives. Uh, it's a space where this storytelling will take place through all the experiences that, uh, you know, you mentioned with respect to events happening, so on and so forth. Uh, so we believe that uh, Broadway should be a place where this generation hangs out. It's a space where uh, this generation is participating in many things happening at Broadway. Uh, and if you're able to do that, I think this generation needs uh, destinations to be created uh, for them to come out of their homes, spend time, meet people. And I think they blend a lot of these experiences along with shopping. So I think that's, that's, our, that's how we believe uh, maybe uh, you know, malls and shopping centers should also evolve uh, in some sense. Something for you, Apurva. See, I think, I think there is, in some sense, we're saying that, uh, you know, Broadway is this new imagination of how retail should be. Uh, and, and it is, should not really be only about retail in some sense, right? And there are many elements apart from the act of retailing that will take place to engage consumers. Uh, so could you share a little bit about what events, what all will Broadway entail uh, to kind of drive this experience for consumers? Sure. You spoke a little bit, uh, Vivek, about you know what the consumer is looking uh, for in the current day and age, and you know why uh, there should be events in the first place. Let me try and again, you know, kind of weave a little bit of a story from the brand kind of side uh, today. And you know, today brands or the kind of brands that we are engaging with at Broadway, which are you know new innovative brands, including D2C brands, 
are engaging with their customers online, which allows them to reach their customer quickly. But as they grow their businesses and uh, you know they come into the offline world, there is an opportunity for experiences beyond what is possible digitally, as well as you know they need a connect offline. They are no longer able to speak to the uh, the consumer uh, uh, offline if they are just lying on a shelf, you know, in a departmental store somewhere, and. Hence, you know, the various events that we are doing kind of cater, allow for the brands to engage with customers in different ways. So even the events, consequently, are of different types, different nature, depending on what fits best into each category and even each brand. It's a very collaborative approach, kind of. So it could, for some brands, mean a fashion show. where We have a you know stage uh, within Broadway, as you're probably aware. We have... It could be for somebody a grooming session because there are consultation rooms uh, built in. For another brand, it could be sampling. Uh, it could be you know a founder telling their story through a founder connect because you know a lot of our consumers want to engage with a particular type of brand which you know has a particular story. There is you know particular kind of founders which you relate to and so on and so forth. Um, it could be uh, you know. Uh, seminars or you know in terms of educating people about benefits of a particular ingredient particular brand etc so you know honestly there is an entire machinery which we are building an entire ip called broadway studios which will cater to uh, brands enable them to do this but i think it's it's a huge array of events that we are able to kind of uh, put together please <laughs> Yes. <laughs> center. <laughs> Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thank you.